Hey, good morning, everybody. Danny Shea. How's everybody? I want to thank y'all for asking how I'm doing with the smoke. Look, windows open. Woohoo! Yay. It still smells a little bit like an ashtray when you first go out, but um, fires are still burning in Northern California. The temperature's a lot lower so they're getting a handle on it supposedly i'm not around it so that's good the fires around me are out yay um the devastation in louisiana oof there we go you know it's just gonna send some white light out around the whole world because we can live in our little microcosm and we forget that there's so much stuff going out there. So I'm just giving just a big hug to everybody that needs it. Animals, plants. And also to the Republican Party, because they need a great big hug. Because, oh my... <clears throat> okay, hang on. Now I'm going to go take a shower. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, much better. I don't know why he said that. But, you know, come on. I love everybody. Um, so, day three's in the books. Yay, I'm, I'm still, like, trying to figure out Donnie Jr. and Kimberly. What, what, what was going on with that? What was going on with that? Let's ask. Let's go right down the old rabbit asshole. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Positive, 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 positive. So, I'm going to backtrack a little bit. Someone asked, is our country in a plague? <laughs> Do we have a curse on our country? And my answer is, hell no. We get to decide. We get to choose. We got to. It's going to be some work. We get to choose this. So, um, what we want. So, we need to have strength. I pulled that card last night. Oh. oh. Strength card. So, um, you want to see it? Strength. And it's for the world. It's got the little tree of life up there. It's so awesome. I'm going to go back and I think about Kenosha and um, all that that's going on up there, too. And I, yikes, you know, so much needs to be changed. And it will change. Right now, we're, we're just feeling so much of the pain that um, it's not a good place to be in for change because it, it, it's too raw. So, if anybody's up there in that area and wants to, or wherever in there, and they want to start protesting, just be really, really careful. Be really careful. Um, we, we can't forget. I think we need to have change on both sides. When a cop has a gun pointed at you and says stop, you should probably stop because they got the gun. However, on the other side, the person that's got the gun pointed at them, they should be able to say, okay, I'm just not going to end up dead because I stopped. So there's change that's got to come. Got to come. And that's where that strength card comes in there because we can't forget it. Cannot forget it until it does change. 
then we have to have strength for something else. <laughs> Never ends. Got to keep having that strength. All right, let's talk about let's talk about Don uh, Donnie Jr. and Kimberly. Kimberly. <laughs> they say it like like uh, Dustin Hoffman and and Tootsie. At least that's what I hear in my head. Kimberly, what's going on? Normally, I wouldn't read on a girlfriend, but she just jumped in. She's part of it. Screaming like that? What? To an empty room? Cray cray? Yeah. Okay. What's going on with that? Ace of Wands. New beginnings. New something. Crossed by. Ten of Cups which is balance and family. I'm not seeing that. Four of Wands, which is a celebration on the beach. Whenever I look at this card though, um, me being a water guy, I go, look out for that rogue wave. There could be a tsunami coming. In the past, Temperance. In the near future, ooh, a little bit of battling going on. Seven of Wands. And in the near future, possible. Oh, that ain't good. Eight of Swords. <laughs> Internally, what are they going through? Some truth. King of Swords. Someone looking at them too? I know someone's looking at Eric. Externally? Hmm. More, more battling. The Knight of Swords. There's something coming up with them. It just pull the cards. Do I need to say more? Just take a look down here. You'll see that? Okay. In review. Yes, please, review. New beginnings. It's... This is a weird Ace of Wands in this deck for me because it's really sharp. It's almost like a sword, okay? So this new, new beginning, new idea, new whatever, it's a double-edged sword. You know, the other Ace of Wands is like the Fred Flintstone. It's like a club. And it's being crossed by this this Ten of Cups energy. Oh yeah, we balance each other out. This is all good. Oh look, we have the Four of Wands. We're, we're in like a little celebration mode, not really looking at what is happening in the ocean, what's coming at us. In the past, it was all good. It was, you know, they kind of balanced each other out here. But now we're getting into, with the Seven of Wands, we're getting into a little bit of, um, what should I say? How can I say this? Uh, just a little bit of conflict. And they're all used to it. Both of them are used to it. And so they manage that pretty well. But it feels pretty restrictive. And they're not liking it. There's some truth coming internally and externally that's going to cause them heartbreak and it's going to bring justice. I, I just pull the cards. Kimberly and Donnie Jr. And I look at that Eight of Swords with the swords going at the neck and I go, is that jail? 
who pays for all their lawyers when they're when they're defending themselves? Oh, that was a government thing. I mean, maybe not Kimberly, but um, Ivanka and Jared. Who who's gonna pay for all that? Their attorney fees. Does anybody know? Do I have to Google it? All right. Well, let's keep. Pardon me. Let's keep it in the family. Eric. What's going on with Eric? He's being investigated by New York, the Trump Organization. Let me shuffle these. Hang on. Okay. Had to clear out that other energy. Eric Trump. Eric. What's going on? He's... He's in a little over his head. You know, and that whole family is in over their head. Melania didn't want this. Wearing that goofy dress. She isn't that dumb, is she? She knows. And does Trump not look at this and say, no, 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 you can't wear that? I mean, I tell my wife what to do all the time. It works really well. So maybe he couldn't. But Eric, what's going on with you, Eric? Eric in the New York AG. What's going on? Eric in the New York AG. It's about the Empire. The Emperor. The Trump Organization being crossed by. Time to move on. Yikes. At the base, he's got a choice. And it has some um, world implication to it, too. Because, see, he's got a ball in his hand. It's like the world. But he's got to make a decision between <laughs> what I just heard. Living in the world or living in prison. Oh, wow. At the back, you have the five of wands. A lot of back and forth, pointing fingers, yelling. And it's all about um, where they're hiding the money. Four coins at the top of this reading in the potential near future. Strength. So, when I pull that, I go, that's what he's going to need, but, or is that what he's going to get? He's going to get strength and fight it. Let's just keep going internally. Another two, so he's got an emotional blind choice that needs to be made and it's about truth externally he's a little alone a little emotional um, he does have news there is news coming but it's not going to make him feel good it's it's a lonely news hopes and fears yeah I'm thinking about this because, I mean, this is, you know, Knight of Wands, more news coming out, but it's backwards news. The guy's looking backwards, and I'm just starting to use this as my Jared Kushner card because it's more of a, this knight is a, more of a feminine energy, and not to say Jared doesn't, it, 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 it not to say Jared has a feminine energy, but not to say he doesn't. Not saying anything. Not saying. That's the outcome. Four swords. Retreat. Jail. <sighs> Good. 
Eric. Go one more. Yeah. Government. I'll pull it down so you all can see. So you don't have to look at my face. So Eric, he's in he's in big trouble, you know. Um it's all about what uh the Trump organization is about. It's being crossed by the death card. He's got some choices that he needs to make, both with these two of wands and the two of swords. And they're they're this one especially is harsh and he's going to be left all out, all alone. Behind him, there is a lot of chat shit going on with, with Don, Donald, the emperor, um, about what to do, what to say. And it's a little heated. It's going back and forth a little bit. I don't know if Eric can talk back to his dad or not. Um, and it's about where they're hiding some money. The four of coins. I'm going to pull on this strength card a little bit. What is... What does that strength card refer to in the potential near future? Queen of Cups, Ace of Swords, King of Swords. This strength is referring to all of the legal troubles that he's going to be dealing with, and he's going to be trying to keep a lid on what he knows and try to keep a lid on his emotions. This Queen of Cups, look at all the water. It's all emotional. Um, and she's got information, too. In the hopes and fears, this is really that he's not going to talk too much. But he's going to open up the box. And he's either going to get sick or he's going to end up in jail. Yikes. How much money would it take for you to be one of Trump's kids? Million? A billion? No takers? Not one of you? I'd do that for a dollar. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, remember that? Network news. I think that was network news. Broadcast news. One of them. I'll do that for a dollar. <laughs> oh my gosh, what a family. Okay, um, moving on. Let's talk about something happy okay let's talk about something happy where are we 18 minutes okay happy 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 what can we talk about happy happy oh the joy not happy humor me <laughs> oh lordy yeah, my cards are all mixed up again wish I could learn to shuffle I get them all in one order, and then they, I shuffle them, and they all get reversed. That's okay. DeJoy. Let's ask two questions. Is he going to be um, subpoenaed to give some truthful information? Let's just ask that first, because if it's no, then we don't need to ask the second one. Are you going to be subpoenaed? Are you going to be subpoenaed? The 
these guys. We have the Empress. Why do I keep thinking Russia with this? We have the Star of Hope. We want him to just tell us, give us the truth. But he's stealing. It's not being truthful. We got that. Um, am I just pro am I just projecting Russia on this? Because I could be, you know. It's it's really hard to read when you're invested in something. It's really hard to, you know. And I, and I try to pull myself away from it, and it's getting harder and harder. The Empress. What? Talk to me about this Empress. I'm really not getting a clear answer on if he's going to be subpoenaed. Talk to me about the Empress. No! <laughs> getting stabbed in the back. It's so much clearer now. Oh, and now it's really clear. Sorry, guys. Just making a little fun. Sorry. One more card. Maybe they can help. Talk to me about the Empress. King of Pentacles. He's protecting Trump, obviously. So, so crazy. I, I'm not quite sure why the Empress came out, but being stabbed in the back, Having to make a choice, and it's a very emotional, blind choice, and it's about the King of Pentacles. So, talk to me about the Seven of Swords. I know what the Star of Hope is. The hope is, is that he'll just give the information up. So, this Seven of Swords... Taking? Is he taking information? Is he leaving enough information? Talk to me about the Seven of Swords and DeJoy and Subpoena. Moving on. Nine of Pentacles. This Seven of Pentacles, he's taking his stuff and leaving. Chariot, he's leaving. The Knight of Pentacles, this is a stationary knight um, with information. He wants to go back to a simpler time. I'm not getting an I I'm not I'm not getting a clear idea on if he's going to be subpoenaed or not. But it the cards do say that he's leaving. So, let me rephrase the question a little bit. <laughs> I just heard no. You made fun of us. We're not going to give you any more information. I didn't mean to make fun. Okay. Let me think. So, my guides were not going to give me any information. They want me to ask this question. Because who cares if DeJoy gets thrown in jail 
Now, what the real question is at this point in time is, will the post office be able to handle our elections and get back on track to deliver essential mail that needs to go out on time? Will the post office get back to being to, to working efficiently within before the election. I wanted to say sooner because a lot of medications are not being post office not bad. Four coins battling. Yeah, but it's it, uh, yeah. So we got the four coins. So that is <clears throat> mail is still being held up. It's still being like kept in a little tent. And there is going to be some more um, investigation about it. However, you have the Ten of Cups. So that is positive. It is going to be balanced. But, and in time for the election. But some people are still going to be suffering with it. Okay, let's move on. One more. How is Donald Trump's speech. I was going to say little speech, which is so demeaning. How is Donald Trump's speech going to go over? You know, isn't it just amazing? You don't hear him talking about Kenosha. You don't hear him talking about um, the hurricane and the devastation. At least I haven't heard it. How's Trump's speech going to be received? What are people going to think about his speech? Okay, I had to shuffle and get quiet. It's like nobody's listening. You know how he was looking when Melania was talking? <laughs> That's what I'm getting. You know, it's like, oh, we gotta sit through this. Eighty cups. Walking away. from an emotional bad time being crossed by battling noobs. Got a feeling it's not going to go over so well at the base. This deck, that doesn't look like he's riding into town winning. It looks like he's being roasted on a fire. In the past, he's hanged man. Suspension. He's looking at things upside down. He's not seeing the truth. The top of the reading is him. The Emperor. And in the potential near future, darkness, darkness. The high priestess, shadow information, not really given the full information, just kind of keeping it on the sly and working its magic, if you want to call it that. All right, internally. <laughs> King of coins. Really? So it's not it's not about the country. You're not thinking about the country. It's just about you and your money. Externally. The world's watching. 
hopes and fears, that there's going to be some kind of balance, that we're going to be able to come together. And the potential final outcome, going back to a simpler time, being crossed by Knight of Cups, information that's coming out that is... This is such a solitary, lonely card to me. You know, in this Six of Cups, he's always talking about, you know, um, you know, just going back in time, respecting our history. But if our history makes people feel bad, well, I don't care. <laughs> you know, and I, we do need to respect it and honor it in its proper place, perhaps a museum or a history book, but not flying a Confederate flag on the presidential limousine, which he, he hasn't done, but wouldn't put it past him. Anyway, so his speech, how's it going to be received? He's going to want to leave after this. I mean, that's people are, or maybe it's just all the people just going, enough is enough. You got to go. Um, too much embattlement. He's going to cause too much chaos. Six of Wands, he's going to be roasted alive. Um, the world is going to be watching. He's going to say, let's go back to a simpler time, but it's really all about. It's just going to isolate him even more at the base of the cup. Well, this is interesting. This is my Joe Biden card, but this is also just protecting from that storm that's coming because of your rhetoric. And it's all about him. It's... It's certainly not about the world. It's all about him. He's got some um, legal things coming up with this Knight of Swords. Reviewing the money. This Knight of Swords is reviewing the money and he's got a choice to make. To keep him out of prison. <laughs> not, four Swords could be just retreat, could be illness. Um... But this Knight of Swords is, it's, you shouldn't run with swords, but this woman's running up, running up that hill with the sword, charging with the truth. And it's about the review of his finances. It sounds to me like that's Letitia James. So... His speech isn't going to go so well. I mean, I don't even think, I, I don't even think he's going to think it's going to go really well. And I know I'm running late, 33 minutes. I like to keep him to 30. I'm a failure. I'm a failure. What is Trump going to think about his speech? Is he going to think it's going well? Is he going to think his speech is going well? Well, that popped out. Is Trump going to think his speech is going well? Yes, he does. In the beginning, thinks it's going to be great. But it's all about his business. Okay, well, wouldn't expect anything less. It's beautiful, it's wonderful, it's awesome. But it's all about his family. It's got nothing to do with the country. Alright you guys, thank you all for watching. 
I appreciate you all. Please stay safe wherever you are. Thank you for my subscribers, um, the new ones, and the ones that have been with me for a while. I was going to say old, and I said, don't say old subscribers. My new ones and my young ones that have been with me for a while. Thank you all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Be safe um, tomorrow. I think I'm going to do... Uh, from September. Can you believe it? We're getting into September. Two months. Two months. Hang on, guys. All right. Peace and love.